my name is debbie and i'm speaking to you straight from the quickle artist search studios assassi radio i'm a producer and you know what time it is it is time for the lion to tell a story tune in and don't go anywhere <laughs> uh, uh we just had a cut in the internet on the african continent several african countries lost their internet service um some for multiple days which just shows us how precarious the matrix the internet is and why we must always have physical books you can see the reading ras merch that is a rastafari brethren which is a reading a physical book and why we have chosen the moniker reading ras and why the symbol is someone holding a physical book is because we overstand the internet can collapse anytime physical books there will always be a need for physical books that's why you see the wealthy families of the world always have a library a trueberry the, the, the prestigious universities always have a trueberry uh, every household should have a trueberry you see uh, mine behind eye and that is just a fraction we have books all over uh, the space that I'm in right now so um books 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 what do you have to tell the people about rastafari light to the world the king of kings and the conquering line of the tribe of judah i like him himself hey yo hey yo hey yeah. Hear them high, hear the black king on the 23rd of July So tell them guy, who prays God up in the sky It's a lie, the almighty, even now you're not From ancient times, them a child Them Romans, know them just up in them suit and ties Criminals, ain't got no alibi They stole my people, then them come spread out them genocide Are you talking about slavery? Them couldn't kill the lion will come conquer to the tribe oh. Go to tribulation I your nice tribe See separation I your nice still rise That's why we tell them In America They brought the far right In every ghetto area We come to tell them In a Toronto Again we're talking about five books For every Rastafari woman Should aspire to read I am the reading Rast And I'm going to give you my recommendations in terms of reading material uh, we just had a cut in the internet on the african continent several african countries lost their internet service um, some for multiple days which just shows us how precarious the matrix the internet is and why we must always have physical books you can see the reading ras merch that is a Rastafari brethren, which is a reading a physical book. And why we have chosen the moniker reading Ras and why the symbol is someone holding a physical book is because we overstand. The internet can collapse anytime. Physical books, there will always be a need for physical books. That's why you see the wealthy families of the world always have a library, a trueberry. The, the prestigious universities always have a trueberry. Uh, every household should have a trueberry. You see uh, mine behind eye, and that is just a fraction. We have books all over uh, the space that I'm in right now. So, um, books, books, books. Can't say enough how important it is to read. We want to bring forward reading uh, right now. It's so crucial in this information age that we're reading not just from the internet because contrary to popular belief all information and knowledge is not on the internet and if you're a researcher you will know what I'm talking about when you look for certain content online and you cannot find it or it's behind a paywall or it's very difficult to get your hands on you know you look at rare books online some of them are out of stock out of print you have to have the physical book to get that knowledge and best believe there's a black market in rare books esoteric knowledge and these things so tune in upon the books now again uh we just did the ballad and the dread podcast i think that might be the fourth or fifth time big up the ballad junior big up atarchi big up all of the panelists i was on with dr knife 
and uh, next brethren uh, professor it was very powerful um, and Chosai I really just give thanks if this is your first episode that you're joining I uh, from the I never knew TV because every time I go on the platform we see uh, the subscribership uh, boost uh, welcome you know and welcome to the lion pride how do you become part of the lion pride if you subscribe you are part of the lion pride big up Romeo King design our sponsor uh, you know I have to big up bongo James uh, from the peacemaker international peacemaker I was in a meeting and the brethren say he had bought Haile Selassie's Ethiopia volume 1 the rise of the priestly warrior kings I am on first book and he said he thought it was just gonna be a dry history but when he read it and saw that it was a story and the narrative was weaved so beautifully with the historical facts you know um, I'm gonna quote Bongo James said I he paid about twenty uh, eight dollars or whatever it was uh, US for the Kindle version he's in Jamaica but he said the book is worth a hundred dollars you know what I mean Bongo James I'm gonna interview Bongo James on the platform and make him talk to the item personally but if you haven't got your copy every Rastafari brethren and sisters should have a copy of Haile Selassie's Ethiopia volume 1 I wrote it with that in mind as a seminal examination of the life and works of his imperial majesty this is just the origin story the birth narrative um, you know told in a way that is exciting uh, we're gonna get ready to start on volume 2 soon if you want to expedite that join the lion pride on patreon we need uh, some financial support so that we can have more time to sit and write and do the research I would love to make a chart to Ethiopia uh, for volume 2 uh, to spend some time at Addis Ababa University and some of the other institutions to get some of the works that can really highlight and make part 2 you know a step up from even part 1 so uh, again join the Lion Pride on Patreon I'll also uh, be posting uh, chapters and different updates in the patreon so if you are here because you read Haile Selassie's Ethiopia you love the author side you love the reading Ras side and there are many sides of I as you continue with I and I on the journey uh, we'll find creative ways to bring out these and highlight these different aspects of my personality and the global brand that we're building in front of your eyes here as a creative uh, so definitely if you want to tap in you want to be early you want to show that support for the author uh, the best way to do that is to join the Lion Pride on Patreon five ten dollars a month uh, contribute so that we can take some time off to really uh, put in uh, to ensure that volume 2 gets there fast I have just written also a fiction novel I'm gonna start releasing some chapters on patreon uh, to get the feed forward from the family so stay tuned uh, for that the author is still active remember it's many sides also have some things coming with the artist this year you've been hearing the music at the ends of the episodes sprinkled in but we're gonna be uh, releasing another mixtape shortly I've been working on that working on uh, I have a, 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 a real beautiful song with TPI grade um, we filmed the, the recording of that with the famous Pam Hall in Jamaica people we have so much content um, we have interviews and pan interviews we haven't released uh, this is a network this is an ecosystem that we're building here and I just want to thank each and every one of you um, for supporting for watching the content and for uh, just traveling with us along this journey all right so all of the housekeeping out of the way let's forward into the topic these are five books that I recommend for the Rastafari woman or the Pan-African woman who is aspiring uh, to trot up within Rastafari or to strengthen herself within the trod 
Book number one, you know what it is. It is the autobiography. And I pulled out the physical books because the reading wrath. Watch out, watch out. Eh? Watch out, hold on, hold on there. Let me get the pause. You see? Reading wrath, no? All right, let me put that away. Um, and I include volume one and two. You cannot be Rastafari and you have not read the autobiography. Now, I know a lot of people, as I said, boys, it's not book thing and this and that and that. Um, however, I'm going to push forward and say, um, you're not serious because if you cannot read and you aspire to be Rastafari, His Majesty was Minister of Education, that means you need to take some adult literacy classes and learn how to read. It's part of the trial. There's no going around it. We don't care what type of bush you want to live in a what type of hills what type of mountain even the man in the hills most of them when you go check them on there they have the other biography put down um big up frontline books uh you can see frontline distribution big up ras uh seku tafari we've been reasoning we're going to be doing uh some type of uh arrangement we're going to have these for sale the other biography um in some type of collaboration we're just working out the logistics so stay tuned i am the reading ras and i am championing physical books we got volume one and my life and ethiopia's progress volume two they come as a set this is the number one uh, book that you should be reading as a rastafari woman uh, it's not a lot about Empress Menin in the book, but it's still very valuable. It does talk about the uh, crowning, the coronation. Um, gives some very important details as it relates to Empress Menin. And he also talks about her character, um, certain little basic things. So make sure you have the autobiography. That's number one. Well, I listen to the first of the Almighty, and this is the Charles March Kwasi. And I and I continue to chant for the black family. Well, holy for African princess and African queens are out there lonely. We tell them seek the most high, and all things shall be added. She said she read Proverbs 31, and this is what she told me. Well, she said she lonely. And it's I, she need, she want to hold me She want I to lead, she said her soul told her She need a king to please, she get the old plus She don't know the things she see, she says she lonely And it's I, she need, she want to hold me She want I to lead, she said her soul told her She need a king to please, she get the old plus She don't know the things she sees Energy no feminine, but she was a feminist Now she start to have regrets, every time she reminisce Remember when she had a man, left him over pettiness Now she look into her heart, heart is filled with heaviness Everybody wanna know who burden is the heaviest Everybody want a little love, but some not ready yet She act tough when she know her heart